Is that you? It is me, Superstar. It is you! Blink! I'm sorry, but I cannot hear that voice and not hear Gregory from Security Breach. But for real, somebody's getting the cold shoulder. And it's not from the storm. Unbelievable. Hey you guys, and welcome to Shan Caravan. In today's video, we're back with more Tears of the Kingdom. I tried to help Jazzman down there. Didn't work. <laughs> I love how there's an enemy right there. Go! What do you mean no? Buddy! I'm not a fan of horses in this game. <laughs> What's that? Is that Hudson again? Hudson dude? How are you everywhere in like a small amount of time? Hmm. His has support on the sides, but not there. I think I know how I can fix this one. Let's see if this works. Can I not talk to you? Bruh. Okay. Ah! Just let go. Yeah. I did it. Uh. How was the president standing? Uh. That was brilliant. <laughs> this dude. To be a Zelda voice actor, all you gotta do is go, uh, ah! huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> Perfect. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. Rupees. Yes, yes. Some food. <laughs> Ooh, a frost resistant. That's awesome. And some palm flowers. Preesh, preesh. With that, I'm off. Okay, we got one. Ooh. So actually, I can... Can delete that stamp. Cause I figured it out. Okay. Could not for life me figure out that other one. And now doing that, now I'm like, hmm, maybe I could have done something similar like that for the other one. Okay. I'm so sorry, horse. Well, well, I don't have a horse. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I think you can call them back when you go to a stable. Looks like I'm doing this on foot. I probably should have just done a slow trot across, but hey, at least now I get my camera angle back. Using that horse was a pain. Why does that sound like there's an enemy? <gasps> Cause there was. Okay, screw you. Ooh, raspberries, wild berry, tangy sweet flavor. So it's for cooking, but it doesn't actually give you anything. <gasps> oh, stilafos? Not stilafos, but listafos, something like that. Bruh. Trying to get to higher ground to see where exactly I need to be. I ain't just trying to mess around and find out, you know what I mean? I'm pretty sure. Let's look at Adventure Log. Regional Phenomenon. I'm close to it. Oh, Jesus, I still gotta be over there. Okay, I'm glad I didn't bring my horse because I don't think I'd be able to travel with him like this. Can I go around? It's a shrine. And prickles. It's interesting. I know it's snowing, but could I? Probably should have saved, but I made it. <laughs> Let's get the shrine, because at least I can teleport back here. Oh god. Oh, nice! I'm already at higher ground. Nice, nice. <laughs> so I've got two shrines on my thing, so 
need two more and then I can get a heart, but I'll wait until I've got four ready. How the heck do I get out of here though? That's the real question. Do I can I burn this stuff? Um sorry, wrong thing. Uh yeah. Yes, I can burn this stuff. Can I like Ah! There we go. Oh! Oh. Okay. We need to go towards green dot. God, it's so dark. Can't see anything. I see a tower. I see a stable. Guess I'll head towards the stable. Can't be too far from the village, right? Oh my god. There are just rocks falling, like, as we speak. Lucky Clover. Lucky Clover, because that. This is insane. It's pretty, but this is insane. What's this say? Flight range, snowy mountain climbing path. But how do I get to the actual village? Looks like the bridge is out. Dang. The bridge is busted. Aww. Let me guess, you have business in Rito Village as well? Well, sorry to disappoint you, but the bridge is down. There's no way across. Since a newspaper ran an article about the Rito food shortage, uh, supply shipments have started to arrive, which is great. Mm. With no bridge, there's no way to transport the goods to Rito. I'm at my wit's end here. Brr, it's cold, especially now that the sun's gone down. Might have to throw another Hillian pine cone on the fire. Those things burnt hot. Last time I stoked the fire with them, it caused a gust of wind that made my bangs all crazy. Frizzy. <laughs> Recently, that guy, uh, Golly, tossed one into the fire next to some newspapers. The papers, they got caught up in the gust of wind and flew all the way to Reno Village. There's no way to treat the written word. So are you trying to say I should use a gust of wind to get across? Y'all finna get me killed. Oh, crap. I actually wanted to hold it. Crap. Okay. <laughs> oh, that worked. Sorry if I burned you, lady. Hey. Oh! I really want to know. Oh. Okay, okay. I was curious what happens, but now I know. <laughs> nice, nice. I really wish I could have like made a bridge or fixed it to help other people, but I guess all that matters is just me getting there. Okay, so this is familiar. So is it the exact same Rito village as before? Like Breath of the Wild? Like I don't recognize most of this terrain. Granted, I wasn't in Breath of the Wild. Like, I never beat Breath of the Wild, so I never played it like that long. Um, Cause I just got sidetracked on side missions, but I haven't really been paying attention to the terrain to see how close the two match up. But this looks pretty familiar. I remember the statue being there. Oh. All set, let's go! Yeah. How are things going, mister? We're about to practice our song. It's called the Song of the Stormwind Ark. We're all going to sing it together to save our village from the upheaval. Are you going to listen to our song? Sure. Yay, we love an audience. We'll give it our best for you. Everyone ready? One, and a two, and... Once a god fell from heaven, stilling the hippo winds. The heavens grew lifeless just as the air blew thin. Oh god. With the world in upheaval, we pledged to help the Lord. A line of ships soared, but as a passage skyward, the god ascended above to a heaven. Wow. Leaving behind an ark. Its winds brought us new life thanks to its great divine spark. You know, the song's about the ark that saved Rito Village a long, long time ago. Something bad happened then, just like it happens even now. So tongue-tied. Hey, that Stormwind ark? Is it 
really real? I'd be so happy if it was. Aww. It definitely is. Papa told me it's always watching over us high in the sky. Aww. We could sure use its help with this awful blizzard. Most of us, the adults, aren't around anymore because of the weird weather. Ah. Well, we don't have the Ark and we don't have the adults. It's up to us kids to take care of the village. Practice is over for today, Jinlei. You're in charge of food. And Mommy, we'll need you to make arrows. Ah. We've got jobs to do, so let's do them. Hey. Yeah. Ah. Kid power. I like code name kids next door. And they're off. So she's just gonna stand there and sing while they actually work. Good to know. <laughs> Aww. Why do you look so sad? Aww. Oh no, I did it again. The beds are too soft and inviting. <laughs> A customer who's sleeping. I, I wasn't sleeping, not me. Welcome to the shall Swallows Roost Inn. We don't have any other guests at the moment, so rest easy and rest well. Uh, <laughs> oh, sorry. Dang. So I guess she was sleeping on the job. I got a store. I need fish though. I ain't that much here. Some food stuffs. Oh, wow, it is only kids here. Hi. Full tummies make for happy Rito. That's why I like learning new meals out of a recipe book. Someone in there that I know everyone would love. Fish pie made with stam staminoca bass. Doesn't that sound yummy? Problem is, I can't leave the village to catch a staminoca bass thanks to this dumb blizzard. If everything else... But if I'm gonna make a fish pie, I need the fish. I need staminoca bass. I don't know that I have that. I just have ancient arowana. Yep. I'm gonna get you some fish. La la la. So yeah, we got all that. My god, that stuff's so expensive. The girl ain't got it like that. I guess if I'd actually fought some creatures, I might have more stuff. All the empty beds. Is the chief still here? Place for you to cook. I believe he was at the top last time. He did say most of the adults were gone though. I remember the, the girl that was here that was like, I need a baked apple. Nothing will make me happy except a baked apple. I'll freeze them. I'll f It'll freeze himself. <laughs> How about this one? Oh, that face. Huh? You need something, mister? Because I'm actually kind of busy. My papa told me you can use ice fruit to freeze monsters solid. Which gave me an amazing idea for an invention. My problem is I can't go out to pick fruit right now with the blizzard and all. Ugh, snow not fair. This is the best invention I've come up with in so long, but without ice fruit, I can't make it. So I gotta help everybody? Huh? Mister, I felt a cold breeze coming from your pouch. <gasps> no way! What's that stuff you've got that's cold, jelly-like stuff? Is that white choo-choo jelly from one of the monsters that'll freeze you solid if you touch it? <gasps> it's not exactly what I had in mind, but I bet I can use that to make my big invention. Oops, I almost forgot. Manners! May I please have one, mister? There you go. Well, awesome. I didn't have to get anything. <laughs> yeah, now I can finally make my invention. When I attach this to the tip of an arrow, it'll make the arrow that can freeze monsters from far away. Sometimes I'm so smart, I scare myself a little. <laughs> I wonder what would happen with other materials you could make f arrows with all sorts of effects. Wow, listen to me. With every breath, I spew out brilliance. Wah. But I should probably stop talking before I give away all my best ideas. Anyway, here's a thank you present. Oh, nice arrows. Oh. You know, the reason I like making arrows is my papa. He creates the strongest bows around. I wanted to make arrows that would go perfectly with his bows. All I have to do is keep working hard, getting my name out there, and one day, ah. I'll be a world famous arrow maker. One my papa can be proud of. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> she say sleepy time? Oh, they're so cute. Hey, there's some adults. Is the chief still here, though? Doesn't look like it. 
Wow. So y'all really just left the kids to fend for themselves? Mmm. That's not fair at all! You know I can handle it! Checking out that huge cloud wouldn't be hard. I could even do it alone! Sounds like Gregory from FNAF. <laughs> Security breach. <laughs> if we don't do anything, the village... Huh? Mm hmm? Huh? Is that you? It is me, Superstar. Aw, that smile! <laughs> so cute. Link, they told me you were missing. It's good to see you doing well. Teba, new Rito elder. Ah, oh, okay. It's very nice to see you again. Is that the same girl from before? She just looks like her. Do you remember my son, Tolan? He's grown taller, though perhaps not yet grown up. Well, maybe I would if you didn't treat me like a hatchling all the time. As long as you still think you can take on the world by yourself, you'll always be my little chick. What? You think I can't? I'm already fully fledged, you know. You'll change that tune when I ace today's scouting trip. You can all keep wasting your time treating that song of the storm wind arc like it's real, but not me. I don't believe in Santa Claus. <laughs> Listen, you... Ugh, unbelievable. Tolan wants me to let him go find what's causing the blizzard, and he's having trouble hearing no. You mentioned a song? Uh. It's an old folk song here in the Rito village. Long, long ago, when we faced a different sort of upheaval, the village was saved thanks to a great flying ship. Or so claims the song that's been passed down through generations. Mm. It's a song for children, mind you. A few adults still parrot it as if it were true. Still, every now and then you get reports among the Rito of a flying ship. Combine that with the blizzard caused by this upheaval and it seems less far-fetched. <sighs> Saw a shrine. Oh, I see. Even the song of the Stormwind Ark is just a children's rhyme. I suspect that there is something lurking high in the sky. But the air is so turbulent now that no Rito can fly close enough to look into it. This is why we say we need to be make more careful preparations to find the truth. But Tolan, he thinks we can cling to that song out of cowardice. Hmm. But these are Rito matters. You came for some purpose, yes? <clears throat> what? This is terrible news. So then not even Hyrule Castle is safe? Princess Zelda's disappearance and the strange phenomena around the world are related somehow. Hmm. We Rito would ordinarily love to contribute to your search, but this abnormal blizzard shows no sign of stopping and food has grown scarce. Scarce. <laughs> Everyone I could spare is already out researching the blizzard or scavenging for food. My husband hasn't been able to leave the village much since becoming the village elder. Hmm. Wish there was something I could do. Ah, huh. oh, but maybe I'm not the one you want. Just try asking Hearth. My friend Hearth has many sources of information, so he might already have a lead about Princess Zelda. You see the two bonfires out that way? Hmm. He's in the lodge near there if you'd like to try visiting him. Town of Rito Village. <laughs>